hundred of people without screaming the word bake. <laughs> to a slightly bewildered and unforgiving crowd, and then launching a technical challenge involved making a sponge cake of 17 stories with a piece of shrimp. Um, so, uh, when I was around seven or eight years old, I developed a stamina. It was really a mild stamina, stamina but it destroyed my life because I couldn't communicate. So I went from being a child who was very active and very sociable to a child who looked down, uh, who couldn't look anyone in the eye, and who could not get my feelings out into the world. And I didn't go to an extremely posh school, I didn't have loads of resources, I couldn't be connected with someone for some time who could give me the speech therapy and the confidence that I needed. But what I did have was a music teacher. And what my music teacher understood was that communication is communication, however you choose to express yourself, whatever medium you use. I didn't have my voice for a while, so she put in my hand a flute. And the sound it made wasn't particularly graceful, what I was saying didn't sound particularly good, but it completely changed my life. And I had the opportunity then to go and play uh, in the Croydon Youth Orchestra. I had the opportunity to learn the piano to do my grades. And then I got the opportunity to sort my voice out, unleashing this monstrosity. <laughs> <laughs> um, it doesn't matter which side of the political divide you fall. Uh, it can't escape your notice that huge cuts have destroyed art funding. They have destroyed the ability for young people, I was once a young person, to do what I did and to have this incredible experience. So I do hope whatever spare cash you have, and I know there's not an inordinate amount of it knocking around at the moment, you'll throw it into a bucket or you'll pledge your support. Uh, I've only spent an afternoon with this extraordinary officer. It's been a real laugh. It's been a real privilege. I'm delighted to be here. So, for your delectation. Do I introduce you now, my darling? <laughs> do you want to speak to our after number? Let's do it after. <laughs> <laughs> Future introduced, we're going to be delivering our Mambo from Westside Flora. <laughs> <laughs> 